we're all familiar with the story of how Kaiser Wilhelm II of Germany abdicated two days before the armistice was signed at the end of World War I. But what happened to him after that is less well known. He actually went into exile in the Netherlands, a country which would remain neutral throughout the conflict. In 1920, he moved into this house in the Dorn region. The former Kaiser was adamant that when he died, his body should not be returned to a Germany that had not restored the monarchy. Therefore, when he did pass away in 1941, he was laid to rest in a purpose-built mausoleum in the grounds of his house in the Netherlands. And it's in this building that the remains of the Kaiser lie to this day. Please subscribe for more.